In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up paid plans and map numbers to those plans on TSMS. First, let's change the type of the number we added. Shared buy is the type where multiple users can purchase it simultaneously. And private buy is the type where only a single user can access it at a time. We will choose private buy for this demo. Once you change the type, you will see a new option is enabled which is manage plans but before we click that, let's just go to the plans menu and add a plan. Each plan created has a rental duration in days. You can change the currency on the settings page. There are two options to map the plan with a number. Option 1 is via the plans page, when you click on map numbers, you will be able to map numbers to this plan. Option 2 is via the numbers page, when you click on manage plans, you will be able to map plans to this number. We've added a quick easily tooltip for your end users to understand the difference between a shared buy and private buy. They can choose a specific number and click on rent. The next step is to choose the plan and the last page gives a summary of the purchase to confirm. Once they submit the order, the plan amount is deducted from their wallet. As you see, I don't have enough balance in the wallet so I'm going to show you guys a demo on how your users can add funds. However, make sure you've enabled at least one payment gateway from the settings page so that your users can add funds to their wallet. We will now try to submit order again. All purchases are instant and your users will be able to view the messages once they purchase a number. They can access their rented numbers directly from the homepage and it also shows when the number is going to expire. Let me show you a demo of how to add a plan from the numbers page in the admin panel. In case if you're facing any issues with the setup, please create a ticket on the link given in the video description.